good morning. Let's go to Animal Kingdom. but uh, I got here a little bit late and uh, I don't know if you can see that line behind me. I am currently standing next to Festival of Lion King. So yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen today <laughs> as much as I would love to. Unfortunately, when I looked even earlier this morning, Lightning Lane wasn't up until like one. Uh, so yeah, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna do some other stuff. We'll probably go try and see Mickey and Minnie because um, I haven't met them yet. I do want to see Chippendale in their dino outfits, but they won't be out until almost 11. But that's okay. So uh, we might do, I don't know, we'll see. I'm just kind of winging it at this point. So uh, yeah, let's have a fun day. I think that's the first time I've ever ridden an Expedition Everest on Front Row. Super awesome. I got that sweet, like, roller coaster whipped hair now. But uh, it's it's hard to beat that ride, especially when you can literally walk on. You just, I literally didn't stop. Walked on Front Row, hung out, good times. I'm gonna head on over to, uh, to Dino Land, see if we can find something to eat now, because I am, I'm hungies. Good old hungies. Come over and join us for the next couple of minutes only. We're going to be 
be out here and having a really fun time with these beautiful birds. So come on in with your phone and camera, ready to go. My name is Meg, I am here with Taylor. Aaron's over there and in the crowd here we have Kayla and Lizzie and we have the coolest job ever. We work here at Disney's Animal Kingdom with about 100 birds just like these two. Their names are Fern and Juniper. And shout out if you know, what kind of birds are these two? Yeah, I heard all the right answers. Parrots, macaws, these are macaws. One of the larger types of parrots found on our planet. And they are military macaws. But there's a bunch of different species. And hopefully you'll be able to see some more in a few minutes. And you can feel free to get nice and close. These perches out here in the crowd. That little fern just landed on. Those are not barriers. You can get nice and close all the way up to the roots of the tree of life, too. Because they might fly right over the top of your head as they're bopping around. And you'll notice that we're passing out their favorite treats, their favorite snacks, usually come in a nutshell. And that's a way that we train our birds to do behaviors like this. Come out here to see all of you is something they've learned through positive reinforcement. So when they do something we like, we, in return, give them something they like, and that increases the chances they're going to do it again and again. So it's pretty cool stuff, really fun tool that we use every day. And you probably use it in your daily life too, with the people in your lives, the pets in your lives. Positive reinforcement is a great way to build relationship and train behavior. So come on in and fill in all this space right here, getting a look at these two. As cute as they are, birds like this make pretty challenging pets to have in the home. We love working with macaws, but none of us would ever want to go home to our very own pet macaw because they come with a huge list of reasons that makes them challenging to live with. That loud voice. That screaming is a natural behavior. They do it quite often in your home. You can imagine how loud it would be, how old it would get. Plus, birds like this can live a really long time, several decades, in fact. Um, they'll probably outlive all of us on our team, which is crazy to think about. And they chew on lots of things. Their beaks are constantly growing, so they'll tear apart things like furniture, drywall, fingers, electronics. They can break in seconds and they go to the bathroom often, so lots of cleanup associated with these birds. Which is why it's so cool that you can see them here at Disney's Animal Kingdom. And speaking of seeing these birds up close, the best part hasn't even happened yet, so if you're walking by, come on over for the next two minutes, guaranteed to be one of the best photos and videos of your entire day here at Animal Kingdom. And you know, despite all the reasons macaws make challenging pets, they're still being taken out of wild places. Things like the illegal pet trade really affects their population, especially with one species that we work with called the blue-throated macaw. It's estimated that they only have about 300 individuals remaining in Bolivia. That's where they're naturally found, and that's all of them that are left in the wild. But it's not all bad news. People have started to notice that things like deforestation and the pet trade are affecting wild macaw populations, and they're starting to do something about it. And we've partnered up with the World Parrot Trust, which is an awesome organization. They are one of the leaders in conservation for wild parrots, and they are breeding blue-throated macaws. And the hope is that they'll be released into the forests of Bolivia, meet up with that really small population of 300, so we can help save beautiful birds like these in skies that look just like this. Cool. 
I actually wasn't expecting that to be there. I was actually on my way over to, I was gonna do Navi River Journey because it was only about a 30 minute wait, but actually I looked at it after the little show and it's now a 50 minute wait. And I'm like, no, this is not happening. This is not happening. We're, we're not doing that today. It's a little, little too much. So we're gonna go wait in line to meet Adventure, Mickey and Minnie because that's what we do. Um, I'm also kind of waiting for food to open. So not a whole lot of breakfast options around here, which is, that's fine. I'm not a huge breakfast person to begin with, but um, everything doesn't open until like 10.30 or something like that. So we're, I think we're gonna get um, some pulled pork mac and cheese. I think that's what I decided we're gonna get for lunch. But yeah, we're gonna go meet Minnie and Mickey first. So let's go do that. Hey! Let me put my stuff down. I'll be. I'm, don't worry. Trust me. I'm coming. It is so hard to see both of you guys at the same time. Oh my gosh! It's so good to see you guys. Hello. I know. You guys are always together, but then I never see you together. It's the worst. I love the Christmas outfits, by the way. It's it's absolutely. I mean, you made them, right? I assume. I assume. Yeah. Of course. Of course. Of course. <laughs> well, I, I would hope so. I mean, if I got something like that, I, I would love it. So I'm not gonna lie. Well, I mean, I can't take that one. <laughs> I know, exactly, exactly. See, she made that one specifically for you. So if I took it, it wouldn't mean quite as much because it was for you. So clearly, exactly. <laughs> oh yeah, there you go, there you go, yeah. I'll see you guys tonight though, by right? Christmas party? Yes. I'm so excited. I will, don't worry. I got I got a light up hat and everything. I'm actually I'm so ready. Yes. There you go, there you go. So can we take some pictures? Of course. Oh. Okay, look right up here. Ready? One, two, three, two. Beautiful, one more, one. All right, so real quick before I go, I have something for the both of you. A present? I do, I have presents. I have presents, let's see. This one's for you, and this one's for you. It's just an extra little thank you from me. Oh, thank you so much. I know. I will say, be careful when you put them on something, especially the eyelashes, as you know. It's always a little challenging. They're real, just real small, so. You just gotta be careful when you put them on, okay? Wonderful to see the both of you again. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. You guys have a great day. I'll see you guys later tonight. Yeah, we'll be seeing we'll, we'll all be decked out and snazzed out, so. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> thank you so much again, guys, appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Well, I hope that turned out okay. I love meeting the two of them. They're always the greatest. It's always so hard to find them together. Like I said, it's it's crazy, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I, I, I don't know. It, it's always characters are everything. I'm telling you, man, cast members who work here are always so amazing. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna walk kind of by the tree of life here. It's kind of loud. Hopefully you guys can still hear me okay. But um, so I don't think I've done a very good job of kind of saying who I am and what I'm doing here, but I'm Michael, these are my adventures. Some Disney, some not, but you know, we're here at Disney now, so let's go ahead and, and do these things. Uh, yeah, I'm excited, I love it. We're just gonna have fun with this and uh, see where life takes us and the adventures and everything, so. I got you guys. <laughs> I had to keep you guys on there. 
I well, you you guys are full. You got all like the the chestnuts and and everything in your mouth. That's why, you know, it's the proper proportions for the amount of food you guys eat, right? <laughs> so it's so good to see you guys. I love your decorations, by the way. They're so good. You did them by yourself. You got you did it just you. Chip didn't help at all. A little bit. Oh, I gotcha, I gotcha. I mean, it still looks good on you. I mean, you, you, you can't go wrong. Ah, okay, you were the visionary, he yeah. was the execution. Yeah. Got it, got it, got it. So, we <laughs> did All right, real quick before I go, I have something for the both of you. Just a little extra surprise for me and an extra thank you. So there's one for you, and one for you. So you guys can read it later when you guys go back and get, grab a snack. I mean, if you want to eat it, you can. I don't think it'll taste very good. It's not like eating a chestnut, so. But yeah, just for you guys, just an extra thank you for me. So thank you guys so much. Oh, oh, group hug. <laughs> you guys want me to hold it for you? So. Pinky promise. <laughs> Bye, friend. Thank you so much. <laughs> Bye, Chip. Well, I think that's going to do it for us here in Animal Kingdom. Uh, I didn't quite get to do everything, but I got to do a lot of awesome things. Things I haven't quite done before. Got to meet a number of characters. Luckily, got to meet Chip and Dale just before they had their little accident, but that's okay. Um, we'll get to it next time, so not a big deal. But tonight which will probably be in the next video. We're going to the Christmas party. So I hope you'll, I'll see you then. We'll see you guys next time.